power of perception. You see, how you perceive a thing determines how you receive a thing. And how you receive determines on whether you'll receive again. You see, the problem isn't the problem. Your attitude, your philosophy is the problem. You see, some people spend most of their time talking about and worshiping the problem that they do on the solution. But what you focus on, you grant reality into your life. You see, Tammy and Susie drive into the same parking lot every Monday through Friday and go to the same job, but Susie is upset about the health benefits, about the air conditioning, about the politics in the office, while Tammy is excited that she gets to have a job, that she gets to pay her bills, that she gets to take her kids to Disneyland with the bonus that she gets every four months. You see, what Susie is upset about, Tammy is grateful for. But your outlook determines your outcome and how you receive a thing determines on whether you receive it again. So six months later, Susie was let go while Tammy was promoted. You see, a lot of people talk about, and guys, get this, if you, if you get this, it will change your life forever. A lot of people talk about being single and they have the perception and the belief that all the good ones are taken. While somebody else with a different perspective has the belief and, and they come from of, wow, look at all this time I have to build myself up before my one comes. How you receive a thing determines on whether you receive it again. And what you focus on expands, you grant it, you put it in your reality. So if you're perceiving and receiving negativity, then that's exactly what you're going to get in your life all day, every day. You see, some people see the word impossible, while others see I'm possible. And what I'm challenging you to do is to step into that space. Step into the space of I'm possible, everything is possible. Because it is. You see, the power of perception will change your entire life. You can either be in heaven or hell, right where you are standing, based on what you're perceiving. And I challenge you right now, today, to take another look at all of the stuff you've been complaining about. Take another look. Reframe and take another look at the bills that you're so upset about because you get to pay them. You have the money to pay your bills, but yet you're upset about them? You created everything in your reality. And if you did, that means you get to be grateful for it. The only way to get more is to be more. And the only way to be more is to become grateful for everything that is. Guys, I am super grateful for you. It has been a blessing having you on this journey with me. If you are new to the tribe, go ahead and click subscribe. If you are not, I love you. And go ahead and share this video. I am, we are, hashtag loves voices going down in a beautiful major way. Ooh. We don't see the nights in the gym with Kobe Bryant shooting those free throws. We don't see Steve Jobs being fired from his own damn company. You see, all of this stuff, all of these things, we're so obsessed with the end result that we miss the fact that failure is a key component.